Hello, hello, lads and girls. This is Lord Kicker, and welcome back to another episode of PC Building Simulator. Okay, let's see. I think I already overclocked this one, right? I think I only went with the GPU. Yeah. Maybe I should just see how much this will actually give me. Okay. We also have a build that needs to be done, so... I guess we should just jump right into it. Okay, there was no need to remove that. Okay, so cables. Should I ask with the black ones? That they're kind of a safe bet. And that's why I tend to go with them. Cause like black works with everything. And, well, it is kind of a dark motherboard. Alright, let's open all these up. Alright, uh, CPU, I'll show the ones that fit. 5800X. I don't think I actually bought one of these before. So this is gonna get interesting. Real interesting. Alright, and go. Two sticks of memory there. Uh, I don't know if I bought more than that. Uh, I guess I could remove those fans. I don't really know where else I could fit this radiator. Because, I mean, I can't really remove Top here, so I can't put it in the front. And it did say it supports a uh, 360 millimeter. Yeah, the top is the only place. All right, cool. Only thing now is that I have those really huge um, case fans. Yeah, 200 millimeters. I actually think I have a few of those. Yeah, I've been removing them a lot. Seriously, the... Okay, uh, what was I going to put in next? Probably a graphics card. Alright, got 245 bucks left. And... Uh, All I need is power supply. Alright. Got 135 bucks left. 
I mean, I kind of would love to put a normal drive in this too, like a storage drive. But I kind of want to see what this puppet can actually do. For more of, can I do some overclocking on this? Uh, let's start with like 50. And work our way up. Okay, how did you do? 9,622. Well, it's worth almost three grand, so... Alright, let's see what we can do with this. I'm thinking maybe some red lights. To go with that uh, radiant card. Interesting, so that one ain't hard to be. And I mean, it's kind of obvious why. I mean, you wouldn't even be able to see it. Well, you would from the inside, though. Alright, let's see. Wow, we didn't increase the heat at all. At least not in idle. Wow, not hitting 80. Okay, let's add 50 more megahertz. And I'm not going to increase the voltage just yet. I kind of want to see how it does. Also, well, 850 should be good enough, right? Yeah, I feel like it should. Alright, here we go. Well, it's almost 15 idle, so what is that, like 3, 4 degrees hotter? And yeah, we're just getting over 80 now. Well, just shy of 85. Hmm, should I just increase by 25 then, maybe? Maybe. Let's increase the voltage too, because I know we were close, so... Alright, let's see. Well, got us up to 88. I kind of feel like we should be able to do 25 more, but uh, that would probably be our limit. Alright, let's see. Idle temps are looking good, but those are not the ones that matter. 
and it also looks like it needs some more power. There we go. Now then, show me what you got. And no throttling, thank you very much. Alright, like, I would say 92. No throttling. Pretty good. Let's see, let's bring you up to 150. Alright, how about 60? How about 65? I mean, I feel like we're getting somewhat close here. I could actually be it. And it was! Well, 170, not bad. Alright, let's put all the lights into red. And let's get a score on this. That actually looks so cool. Yeah, I dig it. Alright, so I'm just gonna let this uh, finish up and I will be right back. Alright, 16,473. I'm actually getting over 12,000 on the CPU. That's, uh, that's actually good. As I said, I think this is my first time trying out a 5800X. And uh, I dig it. I mean, it doesn't always need to be the Ryzen 9, right? For it to be a good PC. But yeah, a storage drive for that would probably be good, because I only put in a 500 gig SSD. At least I would recommend a storage drive if you're gonna put games on there, because they tend to be kinda big. <laughs> okay, um... Well, I kinda want to get some better power supplies before I do anything else. Let's see, that is my inventory. I think this is my storage. Yeah. Alright, let's uh, send you away to a better place. Okay, we did put in an AAO and we did put in some AMD parts, both CPU and GPU. So let's collect. The PC is satisfactory. Alright, awesome. Well, honestly, I feel like that is a good spot to end off this episode. I do hope you have enjoyed it, and I hope to see you all in the next one. Until then, bye-bye!